Hi, Andy. How are you? Good evening. Hello. Good evening. So, how was your day today? Oh, it went well. Okay. I believe you are doing periodic table in school. Yeah, that's true. And I'm sure you know about the periodic table. I've got one for you. And you know what are groups, what are periods, right? Yes. So, should we straight go to some questions? Yeah, that would be nice. Okay. The first question I have for you is two elements A and B belong to group 1 and 2 same period. Compare them with respect to the number of valency electrons. Unvalency. Now okay. you know that group number indicates the number of valency electrons, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So if you have an element A belongs to group 1 and B belongs to group 2. So A would be in group 1. The number of valency electrons would be 1, right? Yeah. And B belongs to group 2. So what will be the number of valency electron here? 2. Good. Now the next question is to find out the valency of these elements A and B. Uh, you would have studied that for metals, the group number is same as the valency, okay? By knowing this, what would be the valency of A? Uh, 1. And what about B? It would be 2. Fantastic. Okay, now the next is, which of the following pairs are chemically dissimilar? Okay, there's uh, sodium and potassium. Then uh -huh. the second is chlorine and uh, bromine. Uh -huh. Third is sodium and chlorine and the fourth one is calcium and zinc. Hmm. Which do you think is the right option? I think it would be the third one, sodium and chlorine. I could be okay. wrong. Yeah. It could be wrong. No, you must be sure. See, sodium and potassium both are metals belonging to group 1. Okay? Chlorine and bromine both are group 7. Okay? Sodium yeah. and chlorine both are different. One is a metal and the other one is a non-metal. And calcium and zinc, both are metals, fine? So, okay. uh, yeah. only sodium is metal and chlorine is non-metal. They are totally different and that's the reason this answer is right. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Good. now I understand. Now, the last one. Which of the following has the greatest tendency to lose electrons? You know how the element will lose or gain electrons? Yeah, according to which group they are in. So, the elements of group 1 have one valency electron, loses it very fast. Element of group 7 has got 7 valency, cannot lose even one electron. So, can you find which is the right answer? Okay, from fluorine, sodium, sulfur and beryllium, uh, I think it will be sodium. Fantastic. Reason? Uh, because it's in the first group. It's in the first group, yeah. It's got one valency electron, which is very easy for it to lose, right? Yeah. So, the right answer is B. Very good. You are really done well. And uh, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, Andy, we are done with the session. Hope you understood the periodic table. Yeah, I did understand. And I enjoyed oh. it too. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, then we see you tomorrow. Okay, thank you. Bye. Bye and good night.